I've spoken a few times on this. Uh, to think about that, the, the fact that race is a false construct. It's a simple statement. Mm -hmm. Now, when I when I when I put it in a sentence, when I put it in a question, I'm asking people. They always start reacting. Oh no! But they're really saying is racism is real, and they're confusing. Uh, and actually, they confuse racism with bigotry. See, you know, as human beings, we're natural bigots. I want to say it that way. Let I me mean, think back in the tribal times. You know, there's a there's a, a woman running around, and, and you you're looking around. There's a bunch of women running around. You say, hey. Who am I going to pick? Now, you might pick somebody that looked like your mama because she raised you. But say your mama's bad to you, so you want to pick somebody that's opposite your mama. Or you might want to pick the fastest girl or the, you know, or the whatever, whatever. So that's bigotry right there. You're slicing out, you see? So that's normal prejudice pick. That's normal. But this race thing, this race was based on this economic uh, uh, reaction to, to, to a rebellion that might happen because of economic situations. When that's basically indentured servants and the slaves were treated with a lower class, if you will, was, was being really um, used by the upper classes, the rich people who make themselves more rich and blah, blah, blah. So you see, that's what race is based on. Now, the thing about racism versus bigotry, anybody can be a bigot. It doesn't take any what we call power. But race, if you're a racist, you have to have power to be a racist. In other words, you have to be able to affect somebody else's life. Now we had that example about you know that that that, that Anslinger guy who's, who was against drugs and he's he was, had intense hatred for black people. He was a race he was a crazy racist, even to the crazy racist. Now that one person was a racist. He but he had the power to do something with his racism. You see, and there's where we we get this little thing happening. Because once, once, we, once we start talking about race and the prejudice, the problem is because they have that false concept of race and they don't want to deal with the real problem, where it comes from, or we deal with it, how do you, how do you, let me put this, how do you defang a racist? How do, you, how do you render a racist powerless? Well, if that race is based on a false construct that was based on uh, trying to thwart an economic system that was going to be a challenge, then we need to change the economic system. That's my basic thesis. You want to get rid of racism? Change the economic system. So we're the powerful people who can always, who can employ not only uh, bigotry and prejudice, but they can also employ racism. They got an extra card in the deck for themselves, or extra five or six cards. We can get rid of that. Because as soon as you bring up a racist thing, then we're all running around this circle or, or fighting this thing that's a false construct. We're fighting it on a certain surface level. We're not getting to the root cause, the radicalness of the economic system. That's why I go back to the blockchain and cryptocurrency, or whatever else you can come up with that can change this. Thing. We have to get out of this economic system because it ain't going no place for us. When I say us, I'm talking about people of my stripe. You see? So it's, uh, it's just been bugging me because, you know, I'm, I'm just through arguing with people about racism. I was like, you can't argue about racism. You ain't got no power. You, ain't get, you can't talk to me about racism. We can't argue about racism. If I want to argue with you, I want to argue about the economic system that the race, racism uh, 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 takes advantage of. That's what I want to argue about. I'm not arguing about racism anymore. Economics. That's it. And that's also a, a dispatch from Arch Director Remetters that that would be me, T, from the Patterson's taking a train to bed letting you know what I only suspect.